Hello again, I'm John Terzak, and welcome to another video recipe by The Seasoned Cook. Today I'm going to answer very quickly a question of, about how to make an apoive sauce or brandy cream sauce. This is a sauce that's traditionally served with French steak apoive, but it's normally made in the pan. And today I'm going to show you how to make it when you're not cooking a steak so that you can use it on a roast or something like that, which is what I'm going to do today. So first, I'm going to take two or three ounces of brandy, so we'll put it in this pan, and we're going to light it on fire so we can burn the brandy off. So I'll let that burn. There we go. Now, what I have here is I have... Um, cup of cream that I reduced the sauce consistency, okay, and I have a cup, which is still simmering here, of brown sauce demi-glaze, which you do have a recipe for here at the Season Cook. I'm going to take the cream and I'm going to mix it into, so I started out with uh, equal parts of cream and uh, brown sauce. I reduced the cream down so it wouldn't water down the brown sauce. Now I'm mixing it in. And you see I now have a tan sauce, which is like a category of sauces as far as I'm concerned. Whenever you take brown and white and mix them together, you end up with tan. So, <clears throat> Do I have to burn all of the alcohol off? No. And the reason why is sometimes you want a little bit of flavor of alcohol in, but I got most of it burned off. I'm going to pour it right in here. I'm going to give that a quick taste. This sauce is good. I'm going to put a splash more brandy in it because it can take it. And you put as much brandy as you want in it. And I'm going to put a few green peppercorns into this sauce just for garnish, for fun. Not something you would have to do, but since it's an apoive sauce, it makes perfect sense to me. And now we're going to put this on a plate so you can see what that consistency is. And there you have it. That's a how to make a classic French a poivre brandy cream sauce not in the saute pan with the steak a poivre. So there you go. I'm using this on a steak a poivre roast that I'm smoking today and that's what I'm making it for. So if you need it, make it. Gotta love it. 